guys and welcome to Barrack Mitsubishi. Today we're doing a walk around video on this 2014 Toyota Hilux SR. Now the very first thing that stands out to me is that big iconic Toyota badging right on the front there alongside that uh, black grilling there with the chrome surrounding just to give it that uh, tougher look to it. Now you do have your very big iconic Toyota headlights here and your indicator is built into the side there. Now down the bottom here you uh, do have your uh, fog light covers there. You can just pop those out and install some fog lights. Kylie, our pre-delivery coordinator, will be able to help you out with that one. Now, looking on the bottom here, there are no stone chips, just it is a touch dirty there, uh, so don't mind that, but there are no stone chips on the front of this car at all. Now, onto that first wheel, that is in excellent condition and uh, the tire itself has a, a lot of life on it there. Now, you do have some minor scratching on the side here, but nothing uh, inconsistent with the age of the vehicle. Now you also have your indicator built into your side fender there, uh, help give anyone next to you an idea of whether you are wanting to merge across. And then you have your Hilux 3.0 uh, D4D badging as well, showing that it is a three litre diesel. Now you do have your blacked out side mirrors and your blacked out door handles as well, uh, just to tie in with the uh, black and white look that we're going for here. Now onto that uh, second wheel, excellent uh, tread on there as well and that wheel is in excellent condition all bar uh, a few minor um, a few minor scratches on there. Now you do have the soft tonneau cover on the top here and opening it up it is as simple as just pulling all of these and opening it up. Now to open up the actual bottom of the tray you do need all of these open and I am not the best at these apologies now flip that up and flip these down and you can pull the tray down now looking in there one thing I would recommend is adding in a tub liner so you can uh, prevent more scratching going on in there and you do actually have your tow bar in there as well now closing it back up, it is the same as before, just in reverse. So we will pop that one in and pop that one in. We'll come back to, uh, to those loops. Uh, moving around to the uh, third wheel here. Again, excellent life on that tire and the wheel itself is in good condition, all bar those few, um, few marks on there. Now your fuel filler cap is on the passenger side here as well, being the safe side, the curb side, so that if you uh, do run out of fuel on the freeway, you are not in oncoming traffic uh, when you are topping it up. Now on this side of the car itself, I cannot fault it in any way. There are no markings whatsoever, all bar again being a touch dirty, but nothing to worry about. So what we're gonna do now is pop open the bonnet and have a look at the engine. All right guys, so looking at the engine of the 2014 Toyota Hilux SR, it is a four cylinder, three litre turbo diesel engine, and the car itself is a five speed manual. Now this car does, this engine does produce 126 kilowatts of power and 343 newton meters of torque. Now being a diesel, this car does have a 76 litre diesel tank, uh, using, eight point, using roughly 8.1 litres to the 100 kilometres, giving you an average fuel distance of 938 kilometres to the tank. All right guys, so here we are inside the Toyota, Toyota Hilux. Now starting over on our driver's side door, you have all four of your power window controls with your driver's side window being an automatic window as well. Um, and then above that you have your window locking controls and your central locking as well. Now just looking through here, you do have your um, power mirror controls down the bottom here. And you do actually have a cup holder here as well when I don't pull it all the way out. Um, in front, right in front of the vent so that you can keep your drink uh, nice and cool as well. Uh, so popping that one back in, looking through the steering wheel over to our uh, right hand stalk, you do have your headlight controls here and your indicators and then on your left hand stalk you have your um, wiper controls. Now the steering wheel itself is in amazing condition. Now you do have all of your Bluetooth controls on the uh, right hand side here and then all of your infotainment controls on the left hand side here. Now, looking through just down the bottom here, you do have your cruise control settings as well. So it is just a matter of pushing in that button on the uh, end there and then setting your cruise control to whatever uh, you might want it to be. Now, moving into our uh, infotainment setting here, you do have your um, Bluetooth controls on the top there. You're seeking for your CDs and your um, radio stations. 
And then if we jump into audio, you do have AM, FM radio, USB, Bluetooth, AUX, and um, AV as well. And if we jump into apps, you do have all of your beautiful Tels not Telstra, um, Toyota provided apps as well, including your um, Toyota help on the end there. Now you do have um, satellite navigation in this model when your phone is connected to it. So it does work off of the um, off of the um, maps on your phone. Now moving down, you do have all of your hard buttons for your heating and cooling and a little dial to change where your air is coming from along with your air conditioning button and a little button to turn your hazards on and off. Now underneath that, you do have an ashtray, but considering most people don't smoke these days, you could just use it to, um, to store some coins or anything. Now looking down again, you do have your 12 volt socket here as well, along with a power heat button. So being a diesel, um, you don't want to run it too much when it is cold, so you can press the power heat button and it heats it right up for you. Now you do also have some blank buttons here as well with your demister buttons, so that if you did want to um, install a light bar, you do have the capability to do so. Now just below that you have an AUX port and a USB port as well, um, just for any other um, uh, music that you might want to listen to. Now moving down from there you do have your manual shifter, hard handbrake and double cup tray there. And then in the console itself, you do have plenty of storage room for anything that you might need to store in the car. So I'll just let the camera do a quick pan around and show you the um, interior of the car and the excellent condition that it's been kept in. taking the time out of your day to watch this walk around video on this uh, Toyota Hilux. Now this car, does, this car does so qualify for our premium mechanical protection plan and what that plan gives you is five years up to 200,000 kilometres of mechanical and electrical coverage over 181 items within the car. Now that plan does so give you 10 years of premium roadside assistance. If you'd like to hear more about this car or that plan please give us a call on 9907 0555.